Looks like we found a little treasure back in here. That's the old beer can, Schlitz. The beer made Milwaukee famous. 1973, well, it's not a bag of money, but it's always interesting to find old stuff. What's up guys and welcome back to bath and shower tile ideas. Let's show you the original bathroom and shower that we're going to remodel. Of course, masks are necessary in some of the clients' homes that we remodel. Let's show you the existing. Here we go. And here it is, 12 by 12 porcelain floor tile. Will be removed, vanity will be removed. This will be an easy demo. We have a fiberglass around here. We're going to cut the flange out, cut this side and that side and remove this in three easy pieces. Remove the floor, delete this vanity, plumb a new valve, raise the shower head. We will have large format porcelain in this shower. We will have porcelain planks for the floor. Time to get to work, here we go. That's the old beer can, Schlitz. The beer made Milwaukee famous. 1973, well, it's not a bag of money, but it's always interesting to find old stuff hidden in old cavities. Time to get back to it. Would you look at that barn. This demo is going fast. Demo is complete, that took one hour to remove the vanity, remove the floor, and this fiberglass surround. We are going to prep, clean this floor. We have a number of high spots on this slab here, so we're going to pour some self-leveling concrete. Obviously prime this first, after we prime it, pour 
our self-leveling concrete so that we have a nice substrate to tile our large three foot planks on. Other than that, this demo went smoothly. Moving on. Here we go. There's our gap. It's about a quarter of an inch there. And here's a second high spot. Again, about a quarter of an inch there. And there's a few more as well. So we want this tile installation to be quick and easy with a nice flat substrate. So self leveler along with edge band will help get the job done quick and easy. Okay guys, the self-leveler is dry and set. Let's show you how to remove the edge band. Okay, the self-leveler is all dry and set up. It is the next day. Let's quickly show you the nice clean substrate and also quickly show you how to remove the edge band around the perimeter as well as around the toilet flange. So here is the bathroom floor, flat, smooth, level, ready for tile installation. Quick and easy to remove this. A simple multi-tool like this, and we will cut it out. Here we go. And we are making progress. We are currently waterproofing the walls, the back and the side. The uh, valve on the right side is currently going in as we speak. There was a delay with the mixing valve, but waterproofing today, we are going to slap the floor in. We have large format porcelain planks, three foot planks. Let's quickly show you our setup right here and what we're going to use to install our floor. So here it is, made in Spain. Wood look, porcelain plank, three foot by eight inches. Of course, we're going to use LevTech for our anti-lippage tuning system. Here is the wall tile, 12 by 24 at a 50% offset. Again, we're using Schluter set, mixing it up right now to complete our waterproofing and all we need to install this right here is our Montelit snapper as well as our grinder with our Montelit blade. So, gonna get right to it, finalize the waterproofing, prep our slab. Of course, we poured self-leveling concrete. It's nice, flat, and level, so the installation will go quick. Here we go, time to get to work.
framing's all done for our niche. We have a prefabricated Schluter niche to install here. We did alter that niche to give it more height and we'll show you what that looks like soon. So here we are, we are going to install this floor at a 33% offset. So we are running our manual tile cutter right now, making our snaps. We will start with folds here and run off the edge of the fiberglass tray. Well, that's it for part one of this bath and shower remodel. Thank you for watching. If you want to see part two, don't forget to tap the subscribe button down there. Waterproofed, the shower's ready for tile. We're going to start tile today. It's going to be a beautiful looking shower, beautiful looking floor as well as bathroom. So stay tuned, subscribe, tap the like button if you enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one.